47 yards in the first seven for Penn State. This is their first possession. It's nothing, nothing. Schaefer cocks and fires and Ron Fleet comes down with the ball. Is it Whoa. Hamilton coming up? Eric Hamilton comes down with a 14-yard reception to the two-yard line. Actually breaking the plane, it would appear, from here. They go second down and goal. This time it's on the ball. Pound them out football. Penn State seven, Oklahoma nothing. Penn State second possession of the game. Schaefer gives up and the Sooners stop it cold at third down and almost ten. Gets it to his tight end, Danidio, and the Sooners come calling on him right at the 16-yard line. Holloway on third and nine. Loops it out. He's got his big tight end, Keith Jackson, who is chopped by Ray Isom, but inside the 35-yard line. Rydell Parr is the Sooners. Now starts the Jim Lasher. A 26-yard attempt. He drills it up, and it looks good. It is, and the Sooners are on the board with 1435 to D.J. Dozier takes some hard hits. Spencer Tillman. Showing that breakaway has speed. minus eight on five rushes. Home run ball. Jackson has it. The All-American tight end is going in. And Oklahoma takes the lead on a 71-yard touchdown play. Again, Bob. The end of it, Keith Jackson, an excellent receiver. You see how steady his head is. Holloway, we expected to be the big rusher tonight. He's got five carries for minus eight yards, but he's two for two throwing it, Don. 84 yards and a touchdown. Both throws to Keith Jackson. Don't worry. A moment of thanks for Jackson right there on the promised land, the end zone. Here's a hand up now. Dozier runs the ball. He's stuffed at the 19 yard line. John Schaefer, a 45% passer, lost the ball. Is it a fumble with the arm forward? It was forward. Rolled an incomplete pass. Here, of course, the Oklahoma defense has turned it up a notch. You see Reed, 40 on the pass rush. Schaefer holds the ball. First and 10, Penn State. John Schaefer on a screen goes to D.J. Dozier, but the Sooners are right there. Has now outscored its opponents in the second quarter over the season, 140 to 10. Intercepted by Sonny Brown. Inside the 30, not done yet. Inside the 15-yard line of Penn State. This is the 31-yard attempt coming up. 5.24 to play in the first half, and Oklahoma looking to extend its lead to 13 to 7. It's like the Sooners do. Roll out, blitz against him, and they get him at the 19-yard line. Lot. Got beat this year. Johnson talked a lot. He's getting beat. 22-yard attempt. Last year's hit on three previous field goal tries from 26, 31, and 21. All right, there again. Could take a toll as the game wears on. Very humid. 21-yard field goal by Lasher. In last year, a guy who gets it done, three for three on field goals, and the Sooners all of a sudden. He should decide to change pitchers down the line. It's unlikely he would until late in the game, but if he should, his backup, Matt Kisner, has had very playing time. Oklahoma gives up the ball. Nine seconds to go in the first half. Bring them to within six and does. Dozier. And the Sooners and Oklahoma right. has the all-time winning first 47 straight game. Running high with the ball is Michael Timpson, a sprinter from Miami, and he crosses midfield, gets down to the 40. Good recovery by Schaefer, and a strike to the video. It's a first down for Penn State. Play at Penn State's drive. Schaefer takes it himself, head down. He's ahead for a first down to the 21-yard line. 12th play of the drive coming up. 9-10 to go third quarter. They're going to air it out again. A long ball. Timpson's out there. Intercepted again. Sonny Brown comes down with his second of the night. Snapper drills it. And Winchester does too as Jim Coates pedals back reverse, to his 49. Reverse. Timpson gets the ball. There's some blockers and 
Michael Thompson cuts it up. Oklahoma has the ball at the Sooners 42-yard line. Reception would seem to be a fumble, but the Sooners get the ball in a first down. Now Holloway turns the corner. The first big gainer he's broken. Hand up to Lydell Carr, and he's down inside the five-yard line. 22-yard attempt. Last year's hit on three previous field goal tries from 26, 31, and 21. All right there again. Tricky with Bob Trumpy, Bob Greasy, and Jim Cephalo at the 1986 Orange Bowl in Miami. Again, this game, the signal event in college football for the fourth time in five years, the national championship on the line. But Spencer Tillman breaks it for the Sooners. And he's all the way out across his 40 to the 41 yard line. 36, Oklahoma. Petra Collins. First down and plenty more as he breaks it inside the Penn State 40. With that array of great runners who can break any play the distance. Jamel Holloway calls his own number. Working hard, he's down. Bumble. Inside. Free ball. Penn State they got it. Have it, and so does the referee. So with 11.05 to play in the game, Penn State trailing 19 to 10 gets the ball. Second and 10 is Schaefer rolls. Lots of pursuit. And lots of hit. Schaefer now 9 for 21, throwing the ball for 70 yards, but the big number, the three interceptions. Throwing a strike. Genidio has it, but there's virtually well, way short of the first down. It's some game. Schaefer, this pass for only 76 yards, was intercepted three times while he was in for the Nittany Lions. Dozier breaks one. First down, Penn State. He's down to the 47-yard line with 6.04. In the this play will start from the same place the last one did. So with backup quarterback Matt Kisner in the game for the Nittany Lions, they now start out in a jam. Down by nine in the fourth quarter, 5.25 to play. And he's going to throw now on first and 25. Whoa. Cyberling has it. He's inside the back from behind all season long to win games and go 11 and 0. Kisner has now put the ball up four times, completed three for 36, and he's ready to fire again. Another strike. Cyberling out of bounds for a first down. Boy. Clark is hit hard by Donnie Jones, linebacker shooting the gap for the Sooners. Play coach Switzer, one to speed up that clock if he can. As the Nittany Lions are challenging now, they have to get in the end zone though to get back in this game. Gesner takes it to the 10. Winner of this wins the national championship. A backup quarterback is in for Penn State. Matt Kisner, and he's completed four or five for 49 yards. Looking in the end zone, he takes a hard hit from Dante Jones on third and four. He got only a yard. Now fourth down comes up. Spencer Tillman working to stay in bounds. He does not. Goes out of bounds at the 33 yard line. Doing the Orange Bowl, Oklahoma, that far away from the national championship. Back to the run go the Sooners, and they break a big one. Off and running is Lydell Carr, and he is going to go the distance. Lydell Carr's in standing up, and the national championship with certainty now belongs to Coach Switzer and his Sooners. 142 to play, and they own it. In and running. Yard markers are moved. Box is stopped momentarily. Don, you realize that with Oklahoma's victory tonight, the only Big A team in bowl competition this year to win. Colorado lost, Nebraska lost, and Oklahoma State lost. Only fitting that another big play by the defense, Liddell Glenn, a junior cornerback, runs it back, and he almost took it the distance as he's down with three seconds to play. And the final numbers are up. Four seconds to go. Clock stop. And it's 25-10, Oklahoma in the lead. And Oklahoma about to grab the golden ring one more time. Well, may I make a suggestion? Last year, the Boomer Schooner cost them a penalty. But when this uh, clock ticks down, I think it has every right to take a joint up and down the field. There'll be no flags, and you'll still get the national championship. I think those ponies are ready to run. Yes, they are. Run south. Well-primed, rested.